Brought to you by ILSCorp.com, the industry leader in online training. Learn more, earn more. Aches and pains are experienced by most of us who, who actually bear weight through our feet, and that's most of us, the whole population of, of the planet Earth. Um, we're, we're bound to the, to the earth by gravity, so as soon as we learn how to walk, um, we start this process, this degeneration of, uh, of our tissues of the body. Now, it can be totally prevented um, and slowed right down by exercising, stretching, diet and exercise. Doing all those four things correctly. There's a lot of people out there who are doing it incorrectly and actually adding more stress to the tissues. But aches and pains, I mean, unless it's, uh, you know, you haven't played your hockey match in five or six months or you haven't been to the gym for five or six months, you're, and you're probably going to feel stiff and sore the next day, nothing that uh, some stretching and a hot shower won't get rid of. Um, and as soon as you get back into the activity, then you'll be fine. If it's something that's ha happened very suddenly um, and it's not the flu, there's no one around you who's got the flu, then you might want to visit your doctor um, just, just in case uh, there's, there's something uh, more than uh, some, something sinister going on. Um, but most aches and pains are, are basically from, from not moving. So, so again, movement is key um, and so you've got to get some stretching done throughout the day even uh, whilst you're working a couple of hours here and there, um, it, w it, won't, it won't hurt. Adam Ridgewell is an osteopath and the owner of the Fredericton Center for Osteopathy in New Brunswick.